Last April, more than 40 children were shocked with stun guns during demonstrations at three Florida prisons. Three people were fired and two others resigned in the aftermath, but now investigators say it may not have been the first time children were zapped during demonstrations. A recently released report says a corrections officer saw a similar incident five years ago, but the officer couldn't remember enough details for officials to investigate. This year, the children, ages 5 to 17, were at the prisons as part of Take Our Daughters and Sons to Work Day. Some of the kids held hands in a circle while one was shocked with a stun gun, passing the shock around the circle. Other children were shocked individually. Some of the children were told they could be first to get hot dogs and hamburgers for lunch if they took part. None of the children were seriously hurt or taken to the hospital. The report says some of the kids laughed afterward and some parents had been asked for permission. Still, department officials call the exercise an inexcusable lapse in judgment. John Belmont, The Associated Press.